In this video, I am going to show you how to download and install BSL shaders for Minecraft Java version 1.21.9. So, let's get started. The first thing you want to do is go to your web browser, and I will have links in the description if you need them. But here, just go to your search bar and search up mod -rinf like so. Now enter, here you'll find modrinf.com, click on modrinf, and then you'll be on the modrinf website. So from there, just go to the top of the website to discover content, then go down to shaders. Now, once you're here, you can either scroll down and find BSR shaders here, or you can search shaders if it doesn't show up and search BSL and it will just show up here. So either way, simply just click on the name of BSL shaders and then you'll be sent here. From there, simply go ahead and go to versions and now you simply want to get the latest version. Even if it says .8 here instead of .9, don't worry, it will still work. So once you're here, simply click the green download button that shows up and you now downloaded BSL shaders. So the next step is to get Iris or Optifine. I'll get Iris in this case. So to get Iris, you simply want to go to a new tab. You want to go to your search bar and search up Iris shaders like so. Now enter, here you'll find irisshaders.dev, click on Iris shaders and this brings you to this page. Here, simply click the download now button and then click the download universal job button. And there you go. And this is all you need to get BSL to work in Minecraft. Although, if you can't run the installer because it's a .jar file, simply go to a new tab, go to your search bar, search up JDK25 or Java25, here you'll find oracle.com, Java downloads, click on that link, and you'll be sent here. From there, to accept all, go ahead and scroll down, you'll find JDK25, click on Windows if you are on Windows, right here. Here, get the x64 installer, which is right here. So click this link to download and install Java25, and then you'll be able to go ahead and actually run the installer. So once you have all of this sorted out, you can minimize or close your web browser. I'll close mine, and from there, you can go to your files explorer, and access your downloads folder. Now, simply double click the iris installer. And now, in the select game version, make sure it is 1.219. And if it is, you can choose iris only or iris plus fabric if you want to add some mods. I'll keep it to default and just click install. Once it's done, just close the installer and open up the Minecraft launcher. With the Minecraft launcher, you'll be able to open up the Iris instance. So that's what we want to do. This is our Iris and Sodium instance. If it doesn't show up, click here and select it. And once you have this, just click play. Here, you'll be able to open up Minecraft and then you'll be able to add BSL to the shader packs folder. So basically, you just have to wait a couple seconds for the game to load up like so. And from there, you'll be able to go ahead and add a shader. The way you add a shader is simply by going to Options, then Video Settings, then Shader Packs, then you want to go to Open Shader Pack Folder, and then you want to go to Downloads, select and copy your shader, go to the top left arrow to go back to the previous folder, and click paste. And now you copy pasted BSL in .minecraft shader packs. Now simply go back to Minecraft, select BSL and click apply. And that activates BSL. If you want to disable BSL, click on shaders, it will disable and click apply. And now you disabled BSL. So I am just going to go in the world to show you without and with shaders. So I'll just leave everything here to how it is. I'll go to a single player world, although you can use a multiplayer or a realm. So I'll just go to a single player world in my specific scenario, and you'll be able to see it working. So this is without shaders, as you can see, this is default Minecraft, just graphics. And if you want to add BSL, you can go to Escape, Options, 
video settings, shade effects, select PSO, and apply. And now you'll be able to see the game with PSO enabled, like so. So we now have PSO enabled, and yeah, that is how the game looks like with PSO. You can of course change some settings, so if I go and escape, options, video settings, shader packs, shader pack settings, here you'll see that we can change some stuff like the profile, we can go ahead and change the environment for example, so we can see that we have different things we can go ahead and mess with if you want, so there's a lot of things you can go ahead and do, you can of course add the actual shader pack config to the well shader packs folder so if i do apply you'll see what i mean here you have a config and you can just share this event if you want so yeah that's one thing you can do if you want but yeah there's quite a lot of things you can just go ahead and mess with so yeah that's something you can do if you want so yeah that is how we download and install bsl for minecraft java version 1.21.9 so if you like this video, make sure to like and subscribe and see you for the next one. Bye.